Hi, I'm Nadine and welcome to Staples Tech TV. Today's episode is about inkjet versus laser printers. You might not think it's the most exciting topic, but it's a pretty important decision to make for your home or small office. So, which one is right for you? The first thing to consider is your printing habits. What do you mostly print? Plain text, graphics, photos, or a mix of each? Second, how much do you print in an average day or week? With that in mind, let me give you some of the pros and cons of each type of printer. First up, inkjet printers. Inkjets are ideal for printing photos as they do a better job than lasers of blending colors smoothly. Some inkjets have special photo ink that creates subtle shading and contours, and special photo paper is available to produce the best results. If you have a highly visual business, such as real estate or design, you should consider an inkjet for photo-heavy promotional materials. Inkjets also allow you to print on a variety of media, including fancy cotton or textured stationery, specially coated fabrics, canvas, banner size sheets, and some can print on specially coated CDs and DVDs. Inkjets are also smaller and lighter than most laser printers and are generally simpler to maintain. Well, that's all fine and dandy, but what are some of the cons of inkjets? First is speed. Compared to laser printers, most inkjets are slow to average performers. Second is plain paper print quality. Some inkjet models produce gray, grainy text or oddly colored graphics when using plain photocopy style paper. A good tip for printing text on paper is to search out inkjet models whose black ink is pigment based rather than dye based. Third is paper handling. Inkjets are designed for small office or home users with lower capacity input trays of 50 to 150 sheets. For office use, look for a model that has 150 to 250 sheet main tray and a standard or optional second tray. And if you print a lot, an automatic duplexing feature is recommended for double-sided printing. And last, tri-color cartridges. Lower end inkjets use tri-color cartridges that contain cyan, magenta, and yellow inks in a single package. This means you have to replace all three colors as soon as you've depleted one of them. Hence, having dedicated cartridges for each color is more cost effective. Now, let's have a look at laser and LED printers. Consider laser and LED printers if you need to print perfect text. They create precisely drawn black text and color text is usually almost as good. If you print mostly text with occasional simple graphics, a laser LED printer is the way to go. Lasers and LEDs print quickly and most are faster than inkjet printers. They are designed to handle high volume printing easily, featuring 150 or 250 sheet input main trays, while some feature automatic duplexing for double-sided printing. Lasers and LEDs also print exclusively on any laser compatible plain paper. Basically, any standard office paper will meet that requirement. That's because these sheets are smooth surfaced and designed to handle the high temperatures of the fuser mechanism. Lasers and LEDs can handle some thicker and banner sized media, but anything heat sensitive cannot be run through them. Some laser printers have high yield cartridge options, which promise a lower cost per page than you get with the standard size cartridges. However, this option is only really beneficial if you print a lot. Otherwise, you have an expensive cartridge sitting in your printer for months. Also, designs that separate the toner from the drum may provide cost savings, so that's something worth considering. 
So, what are the cons with laser and LED printers? Well, the first is mediocre photo quality. These printers can handle simple pie chart level graphics, but they struggle to print smooth looking photographic images. Second would have to be the large size. Lasers are bigger and heavier machines. Some compact lower end lasers are available, but most standard office models are rather bulky and heavy. Third is day to day management. Monochrome laser printers are easy to manage. However, color printers are more complicated because they have four toner cartridges and four drums. If shopping for your office, look for models that come with software that enable you to control access to color features to help with the cost of managing and buying new cartridges. And lastly, if you thought that lasers were cheaper to run than inkjets, well, that is not necessarily the case. Lower end lasers with an affordable price might rely on expensive toner cartridges. So instead of looking simply at the cost of the cartridge, look at the cost per page to get a better idea of how much money you'll spend over time. A cost per color per page of three to five cents is average these days. Anything higher is expensive. Anything lower is a good deal. In summary, Inkjets are an easy to maintain printer, ideal for printing photos and various documents, and have the ability to use different paper types. Lasers and LED printers, on the other hand, are perfect for speedy, high volume printing of plain text or basic graphics. And both are available in space saving, all in one versions for scanning, making copies or with some models, even faxing. Yes, faxing. So there you have it. Hopefully you're a little closer to deciding between an inkjet or a laser printer for your home or office. Check out our website for more info and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks so much for watching Staples Tech TV. See you next time.